Hello there, this is going to be a picture of a person, a person looking out over a large crater and they are stood on the lip of the crater looking down and across it, looking away from you. So we are the commander. And the, the view is pretty good actually, it's a kind of a greenish sky. It's got various colours in it as you go up, so it sort of fades to a sort of tealy blue colour and there's a bit of purpley pink in there as well. I really enjoyed all the colours that you get in it. it it's got tons of colours in it. That was my favourite bit of this picture. I was kind of stupid with this picture. I, um, I had it on the table and I was sat comfortably in a chair. I didn't really have it propped up, so everything in the picture is long and if you look at the figure, it's quite a lot taller than it should be and if you look at the moon it starts off as a bit of an oval so uh, it's not ideal I had to fix it just I, I kind of saved it but I'm still not super proud of how that went <laughs> it's all good though it was enjoyable to do I like um, using my watercolor pencils occasionally and w with the commander in the spacesuit I could use a, a pointy paintbrush to sort of do a little bit more detail on the commander's suit. I took the picture that had been sent which was quite shadowy and I lightened it quite a bit so I could see a bit of definition in the suit's details so it's not quite so silhouetted as it, as it was originally in the in the picture although when you actually just look at it you glance at it it does look quite silhouetted. I like the the gradation of the light falling on the edge of that crater on the far side. I really enjoyed showing how the light was hitting the far side of the crater and then and then some of it was pattering down onto the uh, the ridges on the far side of it. And some of the variations of colours on the on the earth and the way that the light's hitting the, the crater floor. Some of it's because of the light from the star and, and some of it's because of the light of the constituents of the surface. So I thought that was quite interesting. I really like that opportunity to make things look far away that distance and uh, I quite enjoyed the tapering shadow to the feet of the commander as well that gives it a little bit more drama and I, I think that's what makes some people's screenshots really catch your eye because they've thought about that sense of space that feeling that we are going to follow that shadow in and look at the commander and then out and and then look through the commander's eyes across this expanse I think it's a really nicely taken screenshot anyway right I'm going to shut up Thank you for listening, as always, and bye.